I'm Renee Williams, a second grade teacher. You can call me Miss Williams, and here's my fellow teacher. And I'm Miss Bethany, another second grade teacher. And today is Friday, which means if you're a teacher, we have meetings after school. But if you're a student, you get to go home early at 112. Yay! Happy, happy Friday! <laughs> have a great weekend! Yay! Hi, Mesters. This is Miss Anthony again. Today we see the last video and we're gonna wrap it up with Nata. Our staff member from Nata worked very hard to put this video together. So I want to hear from you. What do you have learned? Have you discovered something new about your house? Why they represent Panama and why we're so proud to wear their names? Named after the Nave Chieftain or Cacique in what is now known as Nata in the province of Cocle. with extensive green expands of rich grass for cattle and fertile land for agriculture in the region, fed by Rio Grande and Rio Chico. His town limits went from Chame to the limits of what is currently known as the province of Veraguas, and it had a large wealthy settlement with an abundance of corn, deer, and fish. eventually took Nata's settlement as centers to lead expeditions due to its strategic location. excited to be joining the team of teachers and students here. One interesting thing about me is that I have had the opportunity to live all over the world including Japan and the Czech Republic and Vienna and England and now I'm in Panama. I originally come from Australia and we have lots of really great Australian sayings which I'm hoping to introduce into the Met vernacular. Hope you have a great Friday. I'm looking forward to the end of the week. Have a great day.